Hello, I wanted to share a great resource available to you as an Odella student called OverDrive. OverDrive is our digital library that is free to all Odella students. You are able to browse, preview, and check out books 24-7 without ever leaving your home. Our digital library connects students with a collection of reading materials to supplement their studies, as well as offering titles for pleasure reading. Let's start with how you will access OverDrive. You will start by logging into odella.com and click the log in. You will then use your credentials provided and land on this page. This will have all your courses in it. To find OverDrive, you're going to select your homeroom course. There are two ways to find your OverDrive library once you're in your homeroom. You can click on the course links up at the very top of your screen in the page header and find OverDrive. If you don't like the way it looks on the screen, you can also find it on the landing page under the section called My School Resources, and you can find OverDrive there. So I'm going to go ahead and select OverDrive by clicking on it. Sometimes it can take a second to load into the page, so please be patient. You will then see this login page. Please log in using the same credentials you use for logging into Odella. Click the green sign in button. And now I'm in OverDrive. Please note that you can make your screen expand by clicking the arrows in the right hand corner by your profile. You can also make your screen expand by clicking the button above the number five on your Chromebook. So now I have my page expanded. All it does is get rid of this left hand um, guide here so that I can focus on just OverDrive where I want to be. The library has been set up so that all students K-12 land on the homepage with the K-3 title covers displayed. This was purposely designed to keep younger students from seeing covers that might be deemed inappropriate. After logging in, select the collections link. Note that the grade level collections are grouped by interest level, material appropriate for students in those grade levels. Students may choose material from their interest level and below. For example, a middle grade student can view middle grade and lower grade materials. But if one clicks on the cover of an upper grade book, nothing will happen. Once a co collection is chosen, other options will appear on the left to allow you to refine your search by reading level, subject, format, etc. So you can see the left, the filters that show up on the left. I think I'm going to select a mystery. I really want to read a mystery today and I could even refine more if I wanted to search by the text difficulty or maybe a book that will read to me or even just books that are available now. If I don't want to see books that are not available I can use that filter as well. When looking at the cover of a book you see the white circle at the top right hand corner of the book. If the book is black, it means it's available. If the book is gray, then that means it is already checked out, but you can put a hold on that book. All of the books I'm seeing right now are available because they have a black book inside of them. To borrow a book, you are going to hover over the book. So I think I like this 100 cupboards. I can either sample the book, or if I know it's what I want, I can borrow the book by clicking on the green borrow button. A box will pop up telling you that the book has been moved to your checkouts folder and how many checkouts you have available. You can check out up to three books at a time. To see the books that you currently have checked out, click on the account button on the page header. This is also where you can read rate and return books.
At the end of the learning period of 14 days or two weeks, titles automatically expire and will be returned to the library. So you can see the books I have checked out and here's my 100 cupboards. So I can read the book, I can rate it with stars, or I can return the book. When you are finished reading, please return even if it is before the 14 days so that another student can enjoy the same book you enjoyed. Digital books, both ebooks and audiobooks, are compatible with computers, Chromebooks, smartphones, tablets, and e readers. Titles can be read right in the internet browser or downloaded using the free OverDrive app. To see more information on how the library functions, click on the help link found at the page header. Happy reading!